Okay, so I've got the Chili Pepper logo set up on the screen. I've told it to zero out, zero right off. I did a stepper test. As you can see on the screen, zero is the middle. So I put this in the middle ish. It's not exact, but this is about as middle as I can call it with the way I set it up. So let's see if I can run this code over here. I'm gonna go back up to here. That reset. I'm go all the way at the top, and then we're gonna hit. I don't know if you can see that with as bright as this is, but Chili Pepper has a play, all these stuff, and we're gonna do that. So let's play. Oh, I forgot. Gotta pause after every M6. I don't have it touching, obviously. I don't want to burn out the really cool sticky pad. And there you have it. I believe the bit is set for plastic. So I might get a piece of foam board or something. Something that I won't care about if it breaks. But I don't want to overdo the bit by using a piece of wood or something. And I really don't know where I'm going to be able to find a piece of plastic I can engrave noon on a Sunday. So, I'm just extremely excited that this thing is going exactly as it was intended to do. I'll just watch it all through here. I already tested the emergency stop, it works. And as we know, if I close the lid, it's gonna do its thing, so. Oh, here, watch this. On. Oh, it's done. Yay! I just happened to get it at the same moment it was done. Isn't that funny? And there we have it. It works. Maybe the first thing I should carve is a hello world. I mean, isn't that what all geeks do? There we have it. A Roland EGX or X EGX 300 desktop engraver running completely on the tiny G. CNC board. This is pretty cool. Ah, heck, it's really awesome.